today's video, the most exciting thing happened. Something arrived that we have been waiting for forever. We get to unbox our reborn silicone dolls. So last time we got packaged in the mail, things didn't go as well. You saw this video. Oh my gosh, I'm like scared. When we opened that box, we were expecting silicone dolls. But instead, we got these ones. Here's the doll that I got. It definitely didn't turn out the way I thought it would look. Those weren't silicone dolls. Needless to say, we were shocked. We went with it, but we weren't happy. Hopefully this time they got the order right. Um, I guess it's time to open them. Woo They're heavy. Wait, do we open them? <coughs> yeah. We have a good support system cheering us on. Whoa! silicone dolls came with are these cute little tiny booties oh, yeah. um, this little like wrap around blanket. blanket this hat it came with matching and it came with a hat and uh, and this pacifier oh, it came with a uh, bottle bottle and they came with a birth certificate we got the binkies at the dollar store and we had to cut it to make it a little shorter yeah because the look it goes in perfectly they're so cute <laughs> which is awesome. Jalen was super hungry, guys. Like, look at her bottle. I think Jace was even more hungry. What's that smell? I smell it too. It's not a... Uh... No, it can't be. Right? Oh, Jalen, you need a bath. Oh, Jace. Oh, that's not good. It looks like you're getting your first bath already. Okay. So we have bottles. We have the baby powder and some notes. And I also have this. Um, it's like a little washcloth. So yeah. We need the baby powder after the um, bath because we need to keep the silicone nice and smooth. The silicone babies nice and smooth. The cool thing is that their skin is so lifelike. And can we appreciate how cute this robe is? So cute. All right, we don't need a hat for the bath, so we're just chunky. His head is so cute. And you want to roll it off of the silicone like that because if you pull it, it could scratch the silicone paint. I'm getting Jalen into her bathrobe so she's not cold before her bath. Oh, the sleeves are too big, it's so cute. Okay, so these are 12 inch dolls so it fits perfectly into like these American Girl doll robes. Well, perfect enough. Yeah, it's better than nothing. It's better than being too small. He is so cute. Oh, you're so cute. Bath time is my favorite. All right, so the best 
place to bathe my baby is in my mom's bathroom because there's two sinks, one for Peyton and one for me. And it's shallow enough so we can get the baby clean. We're gonna have some warm water and some cold water. The thing about silicones is that they get pretty sticky, so lots of hair to stick on it. All right, Jace, it's time for your first bath. Silicone babies are very fragile because their head is heavy. You have to support it all the time. Bath time, Jalen. We're bathing our babies together. My baby is covered in little hairs. That's the hardest part, getting all the hairs off. All right, Jason's done with his bath. I've got to dry off his eyes. Let's get you all dry. Water like pools in their eyes and their fingers. And it's really hard to get silicone babies dry. That's why I use Q-tips to get the babies completely dry because you need to get it in like the eye creases and the mouth and just every kind of crease really. I use a blush brush to put a powder on my baby. It really helps the babies not be sticky. My babies feel so smooth now. All right, so our babies are gonna get all bundled up and we're gonna take a break and do a TikTok since they're all powdered. TikTok break! We have this dance that we have been practicing forever. Chase. I got tons of soul on my true collective ball. Yeah. Famous, also famous, number one desirable. I do what I want when I want and how I want it. Leave you with the one in the air, that's how I roll. I got change to throw, I don't care about no gold. Better, so much better, flipping incredible. Always on the show, so they know that I still got I think we need practice a little bit more. I think we did also. Okay, so Steven just got back from school. He's right over there. He hasn't seen our babies yet. So obviously we're gonna prank him. Let's go. All right, this is the room. Let's go. Ugh. Snails. Baby, let's go. Set them down on the bed. We'll do some blanket. Right here, Jordan. Don't worry, he can breathe. Don't cover the face. Okay. No, don't put the hat down. Why does he have so many hats? This. Alright, Hold your breath, kids. Don't say that. Alright. Now we're gonna hide in the closet. Two babies in my house. Okay. Gotcha. Surprise. Why were there two babies on my bed? Where'd you get two babies? They feel so weird. There are silicone babies. Don't you guys have enough babies? Absolutely not. We only have eight. What did I just witness?
and Jack. Alright, Alan and Jack, it's time for bedtime. I'm gonna take care of you guys forever. Alright, let's put the babies to bed. Yeah. Like getting rid of that thing. Not my gecko, Sunny. It's gonna be the family pet, guys. In our nursery? Absolutely. Sunny's gonna be the nanny for the babies. Aren't you, Sunny? Guys, this is Autumn and she's the oldest and the biggest. This is Summer and she's the second oldest. This is Crystal and it's Parker's baby. This is also Parker's baby and her name is Bailey. This is my baby and her name is Bella. This is the first baby I ever got and his name is Leo. This is Taylor's baby and his name is Jaden. This one is Blake's baby and her name is Stella. We have our silicone babies, Jace and Jalen. This is Jace. And this is Jalen. They're twinsies. All together we have 10 babies. We have like an actual baby collection. So with this many babies, we definitely need a nursery. For the past few months, we've been collecting a lot of baby stuff. Here's all the stuff we've been collecting. Yeah, it's a lot. Since we have 10 babies, we need a crib. Yeah, a crib for all 10 babies. And we needed a lot of blankets. I use this as a Moses basket as when I go out with my baby. <laughs> it's perfect and it's totally not meant for a puppy. <laughs> yeah, totally. totally. Uh, next subject. <laughs> if you have a lot of babies, you need a lot of clothes. Yeah, a lot of clothes. A lot of Ooh. <laughs> oh, it filled up. Um, I think I need to learn how to do laundry. <laughs> All right, this is our special caddy. So we have bottles, which we have a lot, as you can tell, plus two extras in here for the silicone babies. Binkies, a lot of them. <laughs> some of them are magnetic, some of them aren't. This is baby powder for the silicone babies. This which, is a brush for it. And we have some of these to get in some of the corners. Because when you have silicone babies, you need to powder them a lot. We also have some spoons and stuff for the toddlers when they aren't gonna eat. This is Summer's brush since he has very tiny hairs. So I just use this. You can't forget the important documents. The birth certificates. We have a diaper bag, so when we go to the park with the kids, we have stuff to pack. And we have toys. We need to get more though. Yeah, because we have 10 kids. And all 10 kids are still in diapers. And they go through a lot of diapers. We have preemie diapers and bigger diapers. Um, we can't forget the wipes and a burp cloth. I made it. <laughs> and a baby carrier, which I'm still figuring out how to use. And last but not least, a boppy. And now that you've seen how much stuff we have, we have a lot of organizing to do and a tiny space. And did I mention, we have a stroller too. All right, let's get to work. First, we need to move all of these chairs. Whoa, don't hurt me. <laughs> now we have more space to work with. Help me grab this crib. We just need to get it out of this space, then we can 
Okay. Um, so we put the crib right here, so it will look a lot better. All the space to work with. The cool part about this um, lock area is that we have four lockers to put things in. This is the girl clothes locker and this is the boy clothes locker. Since it's red and blue, it'll be easier for us to figure it out. I guess we need to go get our stuff. This is gonna be super difficult to go through all of these clothes. Well, this is the um, first one. We need to wash it though. This is the cutest little jacket ever. I know. This is the toddler outfit and it's autumn. Are we rolling up or folding them? Um, fold them. This is Summer's onesie, it's so cute. This is a preemie outfit. It's too little to fit the newborn ones, so we use them as like big outfits for these little ones. Look at how cute this sleeper is. This is my baby. More hats. We have so many hats, guys. This is Leo's. This is Bella's. It's so cute. Probably fit some too. This is a matching set for Bella. It has booties, a hat, and a onesie. And just in case you forgot, this is Bella. Out of the all 10 babies. I'm working on the boys closet, and I'm working on the girls closet. We have so many clothes. Oh, this is so cute. Leo's. No, wait, this is Bella's. Yeah. No, that was Leo's. What? They both can wear it. This is one of Leo's first little onesies. Fun fact this was actually Steven's when he was a baby. He was so tiny. Blake is going to help us organize some more of the hats and stuff. Come here. This goes over here. In the girl locker. Let go. Yeah. We're kind of getting to the end of the basket. These are Jason Jalen's diapers. Tiny. Do we have any matching oh, socks for these? Oh, Look what I just found! Aw, I made Bella a little baby book. All right, so this is her like little, I was gonna tape her birth certificate right here, but I decided not to, because, yeah. I might make a print of it, and then there's like about my daddy and about my mommy, and then there's, I would put some pictures here. And then other pictures. It's a work in progress, guys. Look what I got for summer. Now she can officially wear sorting merch. All right, guys, our nursery is complete and ready to be revealed. Come on in. So Autumn and Summer are playing on the floor with their little stuffed animals. The play area. Yeah, they're in the play area. And they're just playing with their little stuffed animals. So Bella's strapped here in the stroller, ready to go out. And Leo getting ready to have his diaper changed. This is the changing area station where they have the boppy and the blanket and the diapers. Everything is organized, so changing can be fast and easy. We have our bottles and everything else that we need. This is the laundry basket because when they're wearing their clothes, they like to get dirty, so we obviously have to wash them. And speaking of clothes, here is the girls' clothes. So this is toddler, babies, and then silicone. And then the same with this side. So it's actually, since that we don't have any boy toddlers, this is like their accessory for all of them. Then there's baby and then silicone. Okay, this is the silicone. <laughs> this is where I have all my baby stuff. Coming over here is where our silicone babies are sleeping. Mm. Their little cribs. And these babies are having nap time, except for Crystal. She won't seem to go to bed. And Summer's taking a little nap on Autumn right now. And now it's when time starts to get crazy. All the kids are waking up from their naps and we have to get them changed. <laughs> their diapers, their clothes. Because we're going to the pool today. Pete, I'm gonna start changing. Leo, go get the diaper bag ready. Okay, we need diapers. And you can't forget the wipes. I'm gonna grab two bottles. Just in case. And spoons because they already ate. I'm wondering if I need a bigger diaper bag for all of this. Don't forget the teeth. Perfect. 
Alright, my diaper bag is fully packed, and now I have to get some of my kids dressed. I'm so stressed right now, guys. Being a mom's hard. We need two diapers just in case. Alright, my kids are ready to go to school. <laughs> I'm not stressed at all. <laughs> what are you talking about? so easy with just one baby. <laughs> Try three, please. All right, let's get the shade set up. This is the best part about being a mom. Let's go swimming, kids. Are you watching Mommy Swim? This is a lie. Thank you guys for watching today's video. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and click that bell. Just for girls. Just for girls, and we are the Sodi Sisters. If you haven't subscribed yet, do it now. And click that bell and follow us on Instagram. Guys, things are a little stressful today. A little. It's really stressful. Support her neck. We thought we could handle ten kids, but things are getting a little out of hand. Even with three down for a nap, it's still chaos. I don't know if someone's trying to produce something so smelly. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. Oh, so much bit of all over her outfit, so now I need to change her. So we have a little bit of a problem right now. We have a very important camping trip coming up and we need to pack for it right now. But we have 10 babies we're trying to take care of. Which means we need to get a babysitter for the first time ever. Black! What do you need? We're in desperate need of a babysitter. Well, I'm looking for you. This is not gonna be an easy job. Are you sure you're up for it? Easy, I got this in the bag. All right, well, there's 10 of them. So this is where you change the diapers, the changing station, and believe me, you're gonna need to change a lot. And the over here is not feeling too hot. And uh, summer is potty training. Oh. These are all the lockers where we keep all of the clothes. Girls, toddler, baby, newborn. Boys, accessories, baby, newborn. Done. Okay. And they're all gonna get really tired soon and need a nap. All right, then well, I guess we're gonna go then. It's gonna be a while, cause we have to pack. Yep. Bring it, I'm ready. Okay, here you go, here you go. Here you go, here you go. Here you go. And the others aren't napping. Don't her. I got this. It's gonna be tiny work. How do I put these? Get up. This is going to be a lot of work. Alright, now that we're kid free, let's pack. We have matching bags. So we're going to be high up in the mountains, so we need to pack for cold weather and warm weather for the day. You two just stay in the store. There's your baby. That's better. All right, so we both have some tennis shoes and some water shoes for when we take a shower. In the bag we go. I'm going to put it to the side so it helps it stand up more. I think that's a good idea. Wait, I know a way to save room. Put the shoe side of the shoe. Oh, never mind. All right, girls. We're going to feed you now. Let's get you up here.
because it's sunny. Yeah. Should we put the sunscreen in our pocket? I'm gonna give you the drop one and you the unicorn. Okay, now I got two people. Let me cook the dinner ready. Here you go. Um, uh, I don't like it. Um, try this. Uh, here. with the sunscreen, with the bug spray. With the water bottle, with the sunscreen, with those bug spray. <laughs> <laughs> you guys all woke up. Hopefully, Blake's okay with the babies. 
Yeah, it feels weird not having them, but really nice. I'm so glad she was willing to help us so we can do this. Things are kind of getting stressful. Hopefully they come back soon. Help! All packed up. Did you hear that? Oh no, we need to go. most of our reborn dolls. This is Autumn, this is Bella, and that's Zeke. This is, I forgot her name. Oh snap. This is Barbie, Leo, Bella, and Summer. And this is all of their first Halloween. It's like all of them. All, all of them. them. All, of, all them. of them. We were busy this year buying babies <laughs> for your entertainment. This is our closet guys and it's a mess. If you guys watched last week's video, you would know we were on vacation. Our family is driving in our RV to California. We packed for us and our reborn dolls. Shh, don't tell them. Whoa, is this our cabin? We snuck you on the cruise ship. It works. And we had to pack a lot of clothes. Which explains why their closet looks like this. You have to actually open it, Pan. This. So in all this pile of clothes, there's no Halloween costumes. Not a single one. Wait, what's this? Oh, uh, one costume. Look how cute this is. We have one costume, but we need a lot more. <laughs> Back to the video. It looks like Barbie has already taken claim of the duck suit. And she can throw a temper, so we're gonna let her have it. So do we have to go buy costumes for? Six kids? Ugh. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. I think it's some people's nap time. No, but Binky, you're okay. I know it's time for food. Give me a second. Okay, I think some of these need to go down for a nap and we just bring the older ones. Down. Yeah. We need the babysitter for Good night, guys. We'll be right back. After we go shopping. Oh, I love the way Barbie looks in her duck outfit. You all ready for Halloween? Huh? Now we just need to get Halloween costumes for autumn and summer. Do you know who has the best Halloween costumes? Walmart. Don't look at the candy. We need to get costumes. Yeah, we don't need candy. No more. Oh no. Hopefully they have costumes small enough. <laughs> Maybe when you get a little bit older. Oh. This has potential, guys. All of these are way too big, but it is cute. The baby section. They have next stuff. We're here for costumes. Oh, it's perfect. That is perfect. Oh my gosh, look at this one. Okay, how much? Oh my gosh, it's a bear costume. It's okay, it's not. Oh my gosh, look, it's so cute. This will be perfect for the fairy costume, and this will be perfect for the bear costume. Twinsies! Okay. It's, it's okay. okay. It's all right. We're right here. Okay, it's okay. I found socks. Look what I found. We need to stop. We're going to spend all of our money. Time to check out and go trick-or-treating. Toddler. I need another toddler. No, really, we need to get out of this section. Are you ready to see Summer's costume reveal? Da, 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 da. 
a fairy. Summer's a special Halloween fairy. So cute, I love it. Okay, Summer's costume was awesome. But are you ready for Autumn's costume review? Da 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 da! <laughs> How cute! Door, door, door. Right now, we're outside Frightmare's Lagoon with our reborn dolls. Inside, there's candies and treats. So, we're gonna take our dolls trick or treating. Let's go! We're inside. Hopefully, it's not too scary for Summer. Autumn wants to know where the candy is. Huh? You're sure it's Autumn? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, pumpkins. That's spooky. Street, street, that looks like where we need to be. Let's hold your back. Up and down like kangaroo. Here, jump up and down like kangaroo. I can't open it. Kangaroo. Can you? <laughs> oh, wow, that was amazing. Here you guys go. Would you guys like help opening this? Yeah. Oh, you guys such good fight. Wow. Thank you. Yeah? Thank you. Um, Remember, you're gonna get so much candy, you better share it with me. Yeah. Out of three, we have to roar as loud as we can. So one, <gasps> two, three, roar! Roar! Thank you. Thank you. Our dolls have the best costumes. I know. Hey guys! Hi! You wanna go camping with me? Sure! Yeah. Alright, I have to warn you. The last people accidentally pulled Odyssey out, so oh. um, they doused our fire, and oh. we died. Run! 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 Oh, no. Run! 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 Swim to the next shed. Have a great night. I ought to see you later. Is this a jail? Creepy. Ugh. Sorry, Summer and Autumn went to jail for being too cute. Oh, snap. But it's true. Look at you. Let's see what we got. Smarty. Smarty. Oh, Warhead. Sour popping candy. Ooh. Probably too sour for you. I'll pick that. Um, I may have gotten a crushed, deformed warhead, but oh well. Ooh, another warhead. This really isn't good candy for toddlers. I got a Zot. Same. And a Laffy Taffy. Let's get one. Next up, Spookaboo. One, two, three. It's okay, it's okay, she's not scary. Not really. Autumn, you're getting heavy. We have one more to go to. <sighs> Alright, this is the last place where we can get candy summer, and you're looking so cute. And yes, I am eating some of your candy. Thanks for sharing. Whoa! Mom, it's going more! <laughs> it's snowing summer, it's the first time you've ever seen snow. It is. Get a really big pumpkin, medium size, or a tiny little baby pumpkin. A real big one. All right, do you guys like carving your pumpkins or painting? Painting them. Oh. I like painting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're 
did something bad to them. All these wanted posters. And I am sick and tired of being on these wanted posters. Could you take some pictures so I don't have to be wanted no more? Yeah, sure. Alrighty. <laughs> Autumn, what are you wanted for? Being so cute. Help me, I need help. Help me, help me. Guys, Summer got a chef to avocado. Summer, do you want to try riding a ride? Autumn, it's okay, it doesn't look that scary. Let's do this. They're screaming because they're having fun. Okay. Right here. I'm so scared for summer right now. Hold on, Find people out there to do Are you starting? Ah! Okay. Oh, we're on really tight. One roller coaster is enough for autumn. Yeah, I guess summer too. Maybe next year we'll come back when you're a little bit bigger. It's getting late and it's these girls' bedtime. But you're the cutest bear I've ever seen. And you're the cutest fairy I've ever seen. And we and can't forget, forget about, about our cute dad. <laughs> Thank you for watching today's video. Make sure to, to subscribe to our channel. Give us a big thumbs up. And just for girls out, peace. Hi guys. Welcome back to Just For Girls. And we are the Sodi Sisters. If you haven't subscribed yet, do it and click that bell. And, and follow, follow us on Instagram. Instagram. Today we're going on a cruise with our family. And they said there wasn't enough room for Rebo and dolls. Our dolls are family, guys. I couldn't leave Autumn behind. <coughs> they're gonna hear you. And we're just going to bed. Our family is driving in our RV to California. We packed for us and our reborn dolls. Shh, don't tell them. They're getting ready to leave, so we have to sneak on with our dolls. Shh, follow us. I hear him inside, this is gonna be hard. A water snake, dimple, a needle ball, an infinity cube, a simple dimple, and a lot of other pigeons. Isn't that fun? We also have books at night for the bedtime stories. Because we're going to spend four nights on the cruise ship. What? Cup, pup, pup is up. Cup, pup, pup in cup. Pup, cup, cup on pup. All right, so the rest of the stuff that we brought is mostly clothing, because you need clothing when you have toddlers. And binkies and bottles. All right, so we have a bunch of clothes. These two sets are for summer, and these are for autumn. We have hats, two muffs, 
which have a parent side, just in case. Um, two bottles, uh, juice, binkies, bag, brushes, and diapers. These are autumns and these are summers. Wait, are we moving right now? I have to clean this up before everyone sees. Books. Fidgets. Stuffies. Blankets. <laughs> Did we really just get on this without being noticed? We're gonna successfully get autumn and summer on this cruise ship. I just need to pack this up quick before anyone notices. on the ship guys with, with our, our reborn, reborn dolls. dolls. That's the boat we're going on. Oh my gosh, I'm going to look forward. Whoa, is this our cabin? This is awesome. This is so cool. We snuck you on the cruise ship. It worked. Autumn, let me show you around. This is your bed up here, Autumn. Boy, this is where you're sleeping. And look what we have in our cabin, a little giraffe. Jordan, what? I met an elephant, okay? Now we can unpack all your stuff. Cat. And we have a book to read to you guys. Oh my, that may be too old for you. Now let's go explore the ship. So it's almost time for dinner. Our babies are hungry. Damn it, they're starving. <laughs> they're making a scene, we'll get your food. We have a little wait for dinner, so we have to entertain our kids. So we're going to a Fid's restaurant, so Autumn, no yelling, inside voices, um, no eating with your hands, no being a picky eater, have manners. Um, I think we need to learn some of that for ourselves. Shh. While we wait, we're gonna do a reborn doll Q&A. You guys have had a lot of questions about our reborn dolls, Anna and Summer. The first one is, where did we get them? We get ours from dollreborns.com or Amazon. Another question people ask is how old our reborn dolls are. My doll is one years old and 24 inches. My doll is nine months and she's 18 inches. What are their birthdays? Summer's is February 4th. And Autumn's is February 7th. Birthday, Birthday twins. twins! And lastly, what are our dolls' favorite food? Summer's is banana puffs, and I kind of like them too. And Autumn loves applesauce. All right, they're ready for us, let's go. So fancy. I hope this isn't a mistake. Okay, so we're about to get the, we're about to start ordering. We know what we're gonna order. And we got the seating arrangement perfect. And we're about ready to order. We finally got them seated by themselves. But yeah. <clears throat> All right, Autumn, what would you like? We're just gonna get a cheese pizza, french fries, and banana split. Same with Autumn. And we're not gonna eat any of it. None of it. Okay, so the food just came oh in, oh my and God. it's for it's it's for autumn and summer. Jordan, it's oh for autumn and summer, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so right now autumn is eating her fries. Oh, yeah, you should, wait, you should like not do it. Like, Jordan. Like, Okay, so they ate all the food and they just finished their dessert, right? Uh, wait, what's on your face? Huh? 
What's, what's that on your face? Nothing. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. They ate all their food, all their dessert, everything. All right, dinner's done. Time to go put you to bed. <sighs> that was a peaceful night. Speak for yourself. I was awake all night long. Autumn was having nightmares. Now our cruise is officially done. We're back on land. But at least we were able to sneak them on the cruise. Thank you for watching today's video. Give us a big thumbs up. Go to our channel. Just for girls. Oh, peace. Knows the other twin better. I know a lot about Bella. And I do not know anything about Leo. That's sad. Well, it looks like I may win this challenge then. I may surprise you. Then surprise me. I will do it. <laughs> we each came up with nine questions about our babies. Uh, what's your baby's name? Um. <laughs> They're gonna make this challenge a little bit difficult. Rock, paper, scissors to see who goes first. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! I get to ask the first question. Question number one What is Bella's little name? What? Oh my gosh, this is hard. I don't know it. It's not that hard if you actually think about it. How am I supposed to know it? I think All right, time is up. Do you have it? Yes, I do. Right, show me. Ready? Yep. Janet. Janet! Damn. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You got it wrong. Fine, no point for me. That was hard. But now it's my turn to ask my question. Okay, my first question is, what is my favorite color to put Leo in? Ooh. What do I like to put Leo in? Thank you. What color do I like to put Leo in? Mm. Write it down. Does he happen to be wearing it right now? I'm not telling you. Ugh, so many colors to choose from. Leo does look good in everything. He's so cute. But I do have one. One favorite one that I like him in. Okay, I think I have my answer. I hope it's right. <laughs> All right, I gave you enough time. So show me. It's green! Dang <laughs> it! <laughs> I tricked you, right? No. With the blue? Oh, no. So I don't get a point either? It looks like it's zero to zero. Until I ask this question, and then it will stay zero to zero. What? This is an easy one. You should get it right. When is Bella's birthday? Oh, do you seriously not know this? How am I supposed to remember Bella's birthday? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> They're twins. I, I got it. I got it. I, I got it. You deserve negative points for that right now. I cannot believe you right now. All right, reveal your answer in one, two, three. December 25th, Christmas. Oh yeah. Yep, you got it right. One point for me. That was an easy one and you almost got it wrong. My next question is, what is Leo's favorite stuffed animal to sleep with? Oh. He sleeps with a stuffed animal? Yeah. Every night. There's too many stuffed animals to choose from. But he has one. Favorite. I don't know at all. This is so hard. What are you doing? <laughs> You're googling how to spell it. Does that mean that it's a hard word? I'm not googling. I'm just looking at it. The picture. 
Um, I was just checking the time. <laughs> Mine doesn't look like it's about right. Mine doesn't either. <laughs> okay, ready? On three. One, two, three. Koala? Oh, mine's turtle. <laughs> Gums it. The serving. Okay, so at least you have three things to choose from. But it's still hard. Alright, Payne, what's your answer? My answer is. Boom! Applesauce. Mm -hmm. I knew it! Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, you still have one point. Yeah. And you have zero. None. Harsh. Well, my next question is also multiple choice. Choice? What song do I sing to Leo every night? A. Hamilton lyrics. B. Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Star. C. Rewrite the Stars. You sing to your baby every night? Yes, I do. So do I. And this question is super easy. I know the answer. Do you have an answer? Yep, easy. Answer in three. Two, one. Hey, the stars. Mm. Write the stars. I thought it was easy. You don't do that. I listen to you and you think you're looking like right. I sing that to myself. I sing we write the stars to Leo. Because he's a star. His name Leo actually means stars. Alright, my next question is what does Bella mean? Bella? Bella's name actually means something. Crap. Wait, I know because I searched it up once. Wait a second, I'm thinking right now. Don't search it up, you can't search it up. I'm not cheating, I just need to dig it out of my brain. I don't even want to know what your brain looks like. I wish I have one. Wait, do this spell it right? Mom, do this spell it. extra practice in spelling. That doesn't look right, Mom. <laughs> All right, Peyton, show your answer now. Beauty? Yep. Actually? Mm -hmm. <laughs> guess who has not one point, but two points. And guess who both spelled it so horribly wrong. You told me to spell like this! It is spelled right now. Oh. <laughs> That's how you my fault you didn't teach me how to spell. And I got two points. <laughs> Next question. What is Leo's favorite show? Leo's a baby, how does he watch a show? There's what? many shows. Coco Melon, Tinkerbell, <laughs> Hamilton. <laughs> this is so not fair. This is my best guess, I guess. I guess, I guess. <laughs> I guess. All right, Junior, are you ready? Let's see your answer. Coco Melon, trick question. So we actually got him right by not saying he, by saying he doesn't watch anything. Then I did pick Coco Melon, so point for me. I don't know points. All right, next question. This one actually has two answers. Okay. Where is Bella's birthmark? Hide her face. Um. I just gave it away. <laughs> I gave it away. Okay. <laughs> right cheek, left cheek, or forehead? Bella has a birthmark on her face? Because I gave it away. I think I know the answer. 
Let's see. All right, answer on three. One, two, three. Right cheek. No, left cheek. Let me see it. No, let me see it. I wanna see if she has a birthmark? What? Wait, she has a birthmark? This is her left cheek. That's her right cheek. The left cheek, this is my left hand. You said facing this way. No, I said facing this way. My next question is, who is Leo's favorite sibling? Okay, Leo has two siblings, so I need to choose between Autumn or Jay Lynn. I think I know. All right, Jordan, which sibling did you choose? Autumn? Nope, it's Jalen. Oh, dang it. Poor Autumn. All right, my next question is, who did I name Bella's middle name after? This is so easy. What's your middle name again? <laughs> you seriously not remember this? All right, what's your answer? My answer is her great grandma, our grandma. Which grandma are you talking about? Our grandma. Deanne. Okay, you are right. Another point for me. All right, my next question is, does Leo go to bed good or bad? Oh no, I'm too busy dealing with Bella, I don't know. All right, um, I'm just guessing here. What does that say? Bedtime and he's such a bad sleeper. It's okay, he just crawls back. All right, my next question is, what is Bella's favorite color? Your baby has a color, she can't talk. Oh wait, what is my favorite color to put Bella in? Okay, that makes more sense. All right, answer in three, two, one. Pink, hot pink. That's the same thing. Fine, I'll give it to you. All right, my next question is, what is Leo's middle name? Oh, that's easy, I know it. Fine, then say it. You don't want me to write it down? Just say it. Mike. Yep. His middle name is Mike. Another point for me? All right, this is my last and final question. Is Bella a fussy baby or a calm baby? Mm. Well, right now she sounds calm, but I don't know if that's the answer. You just have to guess. All right, Peyton, show your answer in three, two, one. Fussy? No, calm. Calm? Yep. Mm. All right, my last question is, who is Leo's favorite cousin? Cousin? Do we'll I have to choose between Summer and Jace? Oh, okay. He has a favorite cousin. All right, Jordan, tell me your answer. Jace? No, it's Summer. Oh, dang it. I was thinking because he's the only boy, you know? That means I win. I was only down by one point. Thanks for watching today. Give us a big thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, Just for Girls, out, peace! Holiday oh, Stanleys? It's time to go shopping! Target! I love our matching Christmas jammies. Oh, I didn't even know that. <laughs> we're gonna go in and we're only gonna spend a thousand dollars. Yeah, only a thousand. Each. Each. <laughs> Autumn and Leo. Mom is just gonna do a little bit of therapy shopping. Just a little bit. <laughs> oh, summer. Our Charlie Brown Christmas. Christmas time was here. Soft snowflakes floated down from the sky and the oh, I'm getting it. Damn this too. <laughs> Stanley's. Would this look good with my outfit? It does. I need all of them. <laughs> Oh, these are huge. Ooh, it's a food jar. Oh. Well, let me just, let me get up. I don't need any, but there's more. Autumn, don't you want your mom to be a Stanley mom?
baby ring. And that's a deal. <laughs> Pillows. Leo, I have a Christmas tree for you. of these. <laughs> Jordan, Jordan, Jaeger. <gasps> I'm appreciated. <clears throat> I've got to have it. <laughs> <laughs> you can have too many fake ones. <laughs> For Christmas shopping. Yeah. Ridiculous. <laughs> Christmas yarn. <laughs> what? Kind of Christmas if they're wearing Christmas clothes. <laughs> oh, love for <Christmas>. smiles. <laughs> Matching Christmas gem. <laughs> this will fit autumn perfectly. <laughs> Meow <Meowie> Christmas. <laughs> I'm allergic to cats. Ooh. Just because I'm a mom doesn't mean I'm too old to skateboard. Not a good idea. <laughs> I have to have this. It's green. It's Christmassy. What is this? I need this for me to put little chocolates in here for me to, I mean, my kids to eat. Little pine trees on it. Don't worry, mommy's gonna buy you all of the toys to wrap. I have to have one for every year. I'm a dancing cat if you don't know me. I'm a dancing cat, a dancing cat. I'm a dancing cat if you don't know me. I'm a dancing cat, a dancing cat. I'm a dancing cat if you don't know me. I'm a performing cat, performing cat. I'm a dancing cat if you don't know me. I'm a performing cat, a performing cat. I'm a dancing cat. Wow, toys have gotten really advanced. Back in my day, we used to throw rocks and ponds for fun. Is this a toy? Because it's terrifying. Paw Patrol! $30 for this? I'm getting it. I found bingo. Louis. Hold on. It's mommy's. Let go on him. It's mine. Bingo! Is this too much on the top of my Christmas tree? Uh, you only have one Christmas tree? <laughs> Should I get the red one or the gray one? The red one. Both? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> I've seen this new on Pinterest. I didn't know it was this heavy. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. <laughs> I need a new fluffy rug. Sixty dollars. It's the season. I think I've done enough damage here. Starbucks, here we come. Stop. I need to have this. So cute. Back to our hot mom walk. I had to cut 
cut my Stanley budget down this month in order to get it. Sacrifice. Nobody touch this tree. Nobody touch it. it it's off limits. Three feet. Three feet away. Three feet away. Back up. No one touch this tree. I'm so stressed right now. Bella and Summer, we are going to get matching pajamas and we're going to wear it every single night until Christmas Day. And you better believe I'm going to post every single picture to Instagram. Autumn, good job helping me decorate the tree, but um, two ornaments don't go on the same branch. <laughs> Next year, mommy will decorate the whole tree, okay? It's gingerbread houses time. Why are they so small? This is false advertisement. Yes, it is still November, but all my Christmas shopping is done. Yes, I treated myself. This one's for me. It's a Gucci bag. Santa's being nice this year. Mommy, can I help you decorate the gingerbread houses? No, you can watch Mommy decorate it. It's super complicated and I need my gingerbread houses to look the best. Okay. I don't need one Christmas tree. I need one in every single room. Show up. 